All right, thank you, Stephen. Now we're sending things over to Arthur Cade at the exclusive after party at the world premiere of the new film Gay Chorus Deep South. That's right, Sonia. Gay Chorus Deep South is one of the most important pieces of film at the Tribeca Film Festival this year. And I'm chatting with the celebrity attendees on the red carpet. Lance Bass, Gay Chorus Deep South. Yes. Pretty incredible film, isn't it? It was. It's an incredible film, something we all need to kind of be watching and, uh, and just showing the temperature of what's happening in the South right now. You are a pioneer because coming out with all the success with NSYNC and then being able to use your platform, when you look back, what did that mean to you? Uh, you know, being able to use my voice for good has, has been amazing. It was a scary time back then, you know, to come out because, you know, it was, it was different. 15 years ago, it was a career killer. And now, you know, it's no one's scared of that anymore. I think visibility is key. And um, what I think the most important message of the film was, was that we can't really generalize on the type of people that are found within the South. I mean, we've experienced that um, with Queer Eye when we were in Atlanta, but also to see that, that there are people who are loving and love unconditionally and are inclusive even within the church. I think it's a very important story to tell. I was a mess in the theater just watching right now, like crying my eyes out, happy tears, tears of joy. It was just really touching to see a gay men's chorus from San Francisco go to the Bible Belt to conservative um, and in some parts rural America where there's not a whole lot of LGBTQ acceptance and tolerance and, and to see them sort of just share their message through song and have such a visceral impact with the communities there it was just really incredible. Probably one of the most epic things I've seen in a very long time because it shows really where we are as a country right now. We're divided, people feel afraid because of that political divide, yet people are still standing for love and hope. For Celebrity Page, I'm Arthur Cade.